Uh, hi everyone. I wanted to take some time today to show everyone how to get onto the testing portal as the administrator that is proctoring or giving the assessment on uh, the air testing dates. Um, so in this, um, the email from Jim McMahon from the staff meeting, you can click into the PowerPoint presentation that says Air Spring 2018 staff meeting. And if you go to Air Proctor How To Refresher, it's going to take you to a, another uh, Google uh, presentation that has information about testing. And we want to go to the second uh, slide on here. And we're going to make sure that uh, we remember our passwords and we log on to the testing portal and make sure all of that is taken care of ahead of time so that we are not rushing to figure out our passwords or remember them uh, on testing day to make things run a little bit more smoothly. So if you go to the testing portal link on the slideshow and click on that, that's going to take us to this screen that has Welcome to the Ohio Assessments and it has five separate options. We're going to click on the Ohio's State Test Portal, which is the one here on the left. Then that's going to bring us to a page uh, that gives us five options down the left hand side and we're going to click on teachers slash test administrators and then we're going to get seven new options and we're going to want to click on TA interface now remember that all these directions are also in the script on the Google uh, Sheets presentation that um, Mr. McMahon gave to us it's going to take you to this uh, screen where you can log in. Your login should be your Mentor School's email address. And then your password is going to vary. Um, you may have forgotten your password, and it's going to be really crucial that if you forgot your password, you're going to click on this link. Um, it will send you an email, and then you will have to redo your password. Okay? So we cannot get passwords from Pam Farrell. You need to do this on your own if you've forgotten your password. I already did that yesterday, and I'm going to go ahead and log in. And when I log in, you're going to notice that this screen pops up, and it says the pop-up blocker is turned on for the browser. Um, we need to disable it. So in order to do that, if I go up to my URL button, and I click on pop-ups were blocked. I'm going to hit allow and then done. And then I'm going to refresh the page. And once I refresh the page, it's going to give me operational tests and selecting them. So obviously you're going to go to the test that you need to choose on that date, click on the part that you're giving and then start the operational test sessions. Uh, so the pop-up blocker is going to occur. Um, just make sure that after you've done all that, you're going to refresh your screen. If you have any questions, uh, we will have floaters coming around uh, that will be helping out, uh, as well as there will be two of you in there. So um, try to familiar, familiarize yourselves with this in order to be set up for this week, Thursday and Friday. If you have any questions, don't hesitate to email me. Uh, have a great day.